So, the director of sports and youth affairs hosts the hockey inter-school matches uh, of the South Goa schools in the on the mud ground, or this school should be asked to come to Padam and play on the as only Astro Trophy in Goa. That is a question which has been going around in the hockey circles for quite a, some time. Some hockey officials are hell bent in ho hosting the matches. Uh, in South Goa, either in Majorda, Seraulim, or Betalbating ground, and these are these the grounds of the Sports Authority of Goa does not have any astroturf, and they are just mud surfaces or with some places there is some grass. But when the only astroturf is there in the state, why it is difficult for the schools to come all the way to Mapsa and play? There are two schools of thought on this. The physical education teachers say that it costs a lot of amount to travel from uh, south side to Mapsa. Uh, it costs a huge amount of petrol money. Although now with the Goa government providing them buses and diesel uh, in some cases, uh, it is quite subsidized, but still they have an issue with it. And the other thing is some of the schools say their standard is not good because there are no SAG coaches in the south and they don't want to be hum uh, facing humiliating defeats from the North Goa schools who are, uh, whose standards are very high. And the other point of the South Goa teachers is because the South, south Goa district hockey is, tournament is not held, uh, now they have clubbed both the north and the south and they are hosting it in Padem because on account of the non-hosting of the north and the south uh, the south district uh, players are losing marks because the first two, first three uh, schools from each of the districts used to get marks um, which is to help them in the examination point of view but now uh, with the, just the all Goa hockey tournament for inter schools, uh, the schools are lo uh, losing marks. Then there is another contention uh, saying, what is the point in having the infrastructure in the in the north if this north, South Goa schools are not coming and playing on the surfaces? So these are some of the issues which are facing Goans hockey. And other thing is. Some people have been claiming uh, that Goan hockey have introduced hockey in 22 uh, schools. But the plain fact is most of the entries of the Director of Sports and Youth Affairs do not cross 15 in each of the under 15 tournaments in both the boys and the girls section.